Hey guys, and welcome back. Today we're gonna to be driving down to the office. My name is Nick Rowe. I'm a realtor selling million dollar real estate in Silicon Valley and the peninsula. It's not HGTV, but we make it work. This is real life real estate, selling Silicon. In uh, San Jose right now, I'm in Belmont. So a little bit of a drive, but I am heading in to take a class. Shout out to KW Silicon City. This one's gonna be a good one. Top 10 mistakes that agents make. So it's great they go through what they're actually seeing, the legal cases and things like that. Do let us know what to do to not get sued. And that is always the goal. My team, we've been doing this for 18, about 20 years or so. Haven't had a lawsuit yet, just knock on wood. But it is because we are diligent and we are always just watching what is going on. I always clear my schedule whenever there's some sort of a broker update, legal update, anything like that. You gotta make the time to check into it because that's the arena. So we just finished up the class. It was pretty great moving forward. The trend that really showed up is one, Elder abuse is going to be something that is going to be taken a lot more seriously. So a lot of agents need to definitely watch out if you're dealing with anybody over 65, really anybody who's elderly. Make sure that you keep yourself safe. Make sure that whoever's there is on board with it. Have a witness in the room. If the deal doesn't look right, don't go forward with it. As realtors, we have a fiduciary duty to the client, which means we have to act in their best interest at all times, especially when it comes to something financial. So just make sure that the move makes sense. Make sure that there is a witness there with you who can vouch that you aren't taking advantage of anybody. The reason why I say this is going to be so much more important in the next few years is we got that baby boomer demographic that's just ready to go. One in eight sellers, I believe, are seniors. As the generational wealth transfer, the largest wealth transfer is gonna start happening from the baby boomer generation down the line. Seniors start to sell, older people start to sell. There's gonna be a lot of people who might be doing some questionable things. Don't be one of them. Always act in the best interest of the client and always keep records of everything. So if you have to go to court, you can say, no, nope, I did not do that. I sent them to their financial advisor. I talked to their heirs. You know, it's pretty obvious when these things are on the up and up, but just have another set of eyes with the person there. Yeah, so again, not legal advice. I'm just saying that I think that that's going to be a big trend that we're gonna see is elder abuse cases are gonna be taken a lot more seriously, especially because there's a lot of money that's gonna start transferring hands. So just watch out for that and make sure that you are taking all the steps to protect yourself and to protect them. I'm gonna go get some fabric from Joanne's. <laughs> uh, my fiance loves to, uh, to sew and knit and I promised her yesterday that we would uh, pick up something. So here we go. My God, my Lord. They say real estate agents are expensive. Sorry. <laughs> Every time I walk into Joanne's, I walk out of there feeling like I've been swindled by a casino. Even when you get the discounts, you're still losing money. Good marketing, but oh my God. Just for what, a few pieces of yarn? 